Hello friends, this is Amol Ghar from Vidisha Infotech. In this video, we will be going to learn about operators in Java. In our previous lecture, we have seen how to code an assignment, sorry, arithmetic operator. And in today's video, we will be learning how to code bitwise operator, logical operator and the relational operators. Now, let's see what are bitwise operators. In bitwise operator, we have AND that connects two statements. Then we have OR denoted by a straight line and binary OR or we can say exclusive OR denoted as XOR. Now, the calculation of this bitwise operator is done by binary coding and is done by the computer itself. Means we can say in other words machine language. So this is the bitwise operator, logical operator. Now logical operator is also and but it is denoted as double. Then same or operator. So this comes in the logical operators. But for logical operators, we will be seeing in the next video the example. Because it can it will be having the code for if statement. So we will be seeing the logical operators in our if statements. And the next is relational operators. Now let's see. What are relational operators? X grade less than Y less than X, X greater than Y x equal equal to y x not equal to y then x less than or equal to y less than or equal to y or and the final one is x greater than or equal to y So is this clear for everyone? So let's get started with the programming. This I will save it for my reference. Now I'll take a new page and will code it. First is for 
bit wise output. Yes, my main coding start. So I have declared two integers values that is x and y. For two and a half unit has ten and semicolon. Then and again integer y equal to. Let this copy it. So here it is. value of y is so in this way I have created a program that shows me how to operate a bitwise operator so that I will save it as bitwise dot java And save it. Before going to compile it, I'll copy this so that I can paste it in my next program. So let's just compile it. I'll open my CMD and change it to desktop.
here the program successfully executes. Now we will run the program. What else? So here it is. Bitwise and gives us zero because the condition is false. Bitwise or gives us the addition of this two that is 30. And exclusive or also gives us the value as 30. The value of x is 10 and the value of y is 20. So, is it clear? Here is the code and here is the output. So, let's get started with the next program that is relational operator. So I'll take a new file. I'll paste it. Here I will change it to relational. So here I'll do the changes. That is x greater than y, sorry, x less than y, x greater than y, then x equal equal to y. the value and just put an enter and paste it x then not equal to y less than equal to y greater than equal to y and x less than or equal to y so here less than equal to then equal to then not equal to greater than and less than so here it is here I have taken integer uh, x equal to 10 and integer y equal to 20 
and then I am printing its value that is x and y then I am saying that is x is less than y then I am printing x greater than y here what will happen it will check the condition whether it is true or false and it will return as a boolean value means that is it is either true or either false so let's see let's save it as Execute successfully. So here is the result. You can see the value of x is 10, the value of y is 20. Now x is less than y, that is true because y is greater than x so here then the value of x is greater than y it is false because x is 10 and y is 20 then is it equal to y no it is not it is not then there is condition it is not equal to y then yes the condition is true then greater than or equal to y it is false x is less than or equal to y yes that condition makes it true so this is the code have a look at it so that's it in this video keep watching for the next video have a nice day